Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Just as promised, we have our pack comparison opening for you guys today. We have here on the right NBA Hoops Fat Packs, again, that we got from Best Buy on sale at $6.99, no, uh, $5.99 each, actually. Yeah, six bucks per Fat Pack, 30 cards. And on the left, we have the Panini Illusions 2021 through 2022. Uh, these are just normal packs, but on Dave and Adam's Card World, they were selling them. Super sale, $2.95 a piece, which was really awesome. So we were able to get eight of those. And I think, how many cards per pack here? Um, let me take a double look at this. Doesn't say, hmm. Oh, 12 cards, 12 cards per pack. So looking at 12 times A is like 96 roughly. Yeah, no, no, yeah, not roughly, 96 cards. And then we got five of the 30, so 150. That's not even, but these are comparison pack value openings, but enough of that. We'll just get right into it and we'll see which one fares better and possibly what is the better deal. In my opinion, it's not that bad right now, like 30 bucks for essentially each side. I'd go and pick it up, but I will definitely let you guys know for sure right after this opening to see what value is held inside. All right, let's get it. Let's go ahead and start with these Panini Illusions since we already kind of know what's inside the... NBA Hoops Packs. You know what? I think we need a blade for this. Cut it down. Cut this open. Alright, first pack luck. Let's see what we get here. I haven't really opened these cards yet, so I don't know what we're about to get, but we'll see. All right, so we got DeAndre Hunter. These look like all, oh, not all rookies, but the, it says there's key rookies to be selecting here. Evan Mobley, Josh Giddy, Cade Cunningham, and Sky Barnes. Sorry about that. I do like the artwork. Look at this. This is pretty cool. James Harden. Damn, that Luka card looks really sweet uh, for a pretty cool for a base set. I think I might hold on to that just to see. We got Anthony Edwards base set card. These are really cool. I'm going to set aside some of the cards that I actually like here. Let's continue. Looks like we got Drew Holiday. Julius Randle. Trey Murphy. This one's a little bit different. A little bronze color. Oh, it's a... It's a rookie card, that's why. We'll hold on to that. Oh! Dang. Alright, this is a pretty, pretty cool. Look at this. It's like a gilded card. Damian Lillard, king of cards. Dang it, it's like foiled out and everything. Look at that raised lettering, raised etching. Really, really cool. Dang, alright, we're gonna have to check out the value on that one. Hold on to that. Uh, Paul Pierce here. Oh, it looks like we're getting the Celtics. Maybe it'd be crazy if we got all three, but I don't think so. Ray Allen. Missing KG. Santi Aldama. And Evan Mobley for the rookie. Nice. I think that was one of the key cards we wanted to get, too. Let's continue with the second pack here. I think there is quite a bit of a higher ceiling maybe for these Panini Illusions, even though they went on sale. As I know, NBA Hoops is a little bit on the lower end of tier as well. Let's continue. Chris Stapps Perzingis. And D'Angelo Russell. I'm just going a bit slower here because we haven't seen these cards before. Take a time to look at the artwork. CJ McCollum. Kobe White, LeBron James, I'm gonna hold on to this one. I don't think I have a base set of that. Boyan Bogdanovich, I think we have a rookie here. Devin Vassell, no, not a rookie. I don't think so, set that aside. Instant Impact, awesome. Quentin Grimes, 
for the Knicks. That is really cool. That's a dope rookie card, I think. I'm not sure. Oh, nice. The inserts here are pretty intricate. Miles Turner. Jason Williams, little throwback card. That's kind of cool. And rookie card, Trendon Watford. And rookie card, Usman Garuba. Oh, dang, I've been saying this aside in the wrong spots. Give me a second. Okay, there we go. Fix the piles. We'll check this. Sorry, cool. Dropping everything. So let me let's go on a third pack. Let's keep this moving. Drop that down. All right, let's see what we got next. Emmanuel quickly. Rui Hachimura. Devin Booker. Chris Middleton, RJ Barrett, Bradley Beal, Afrani Simmons. Oh, nice. Look at this. Shining Stars LeBron. The thing is, I don't know. Like, there's no, like, hollow difference. But, like, since they're all gilded, they all look really good. Especially with these inserts. This is freaking awesome. Look at that. All raised. I love how the cards aren't ruined either. Super straight. Shoutouts to Devin Adams Card World for sending over like untainted packs. I know like hanger packs like this always get dented along the way. Patrick Beverly. Charles Barkley throwback. Who we got here? Ooh. All right. Some little rookies. Charles Bassey and Trey Mann. Set those rookies aside. Let's continue. I'm pretty happy with these cards so far. I mean, it's definitely a new since we don't really know what's, what we're getting in here. Probably should have looked up what the main hits were to get, but looks like we're getting something every pack and really cool inserts so far. Everything's gilded and pretty cool. All right, let's see here. Buddy healed. Kevin Durant, set that aside. Just inside the base cards, which I think are really cool. Nikola Jokic, let's set that one aside too. And the champ. Dennis Schroeder. Boyan Bogdanovich. A rookie, Ayo Dasunmu. Oh shoot, I think we pulled Steph. Holy sh All right, let's go. Look at this. Intriguing players, Stephen Curry. Dang, there's the, I don't know if this is like a really good card, but these inserts were hitting like really big names. This is awesome. Nice guild there. Nice little raise. Some texture to the card too. Awesome. Set that aside. So we'll sleeve that up for sure. Afrani Simmons. That's crazy. So I'm starting to realize I need to go back because I saw there was a bronze version of this. Maybe they're like variants. That is really strange. I need to figure that out, too. Allen Iverson. <laughs> cool. Isaiah Livers, rookie card. Set that aside. Oh, and look at this. We have a Spurs rookie card. Joshua Primo. Let's continue. Yeah, definitely a higher ceiling for these ones. Getting some nice little inserts here. And not so much in the set aside base base stock pile. Cool to see too. They have like old school players inside the inside some of the base set cards too. Random little insertion of like Hall of Famers, I guess. All right, let's go. Oh, cool! Tyler Hero base set. Put that one to the side too. That's pretty cool. Pascal Siakam, got Russell Westbrook, Darius Garland, 
LaMelo Ball, Tyrese Maxey. You got a rookie up here. Davion Mitchell, nice. Cool to get a Paolo Bancaro or something like that. Ooh, looks like another Gilded card, King of Cards. Trey Young, sweet silver too. I think that's the same as the Damon Lillard one, but still really cool. Laurie Markinen. Oh, we did get Kate. All right, and we're here on the last pack now. Let's get this going. All right, let's see if we get some last pack luck here before we do the comparison. All right, Jimmy Butler. Sorry, sorting some stuff here. O'Shea Brissett, Joe Harris, Kevin Love, P.J. Washington Jr., George Hill, Grant Williams, Terrace Garland, Kevin Porter Jr., Keldon Johnson, Jalen Shuggs, Jalen Suggs, Cameron Johnson, Bones Highland, DeJounte Murray, Gary Harris, DeAndre Eaton. Oh, let's go. Paul Bencaro, nice little rookie. Pick them up. Can add this to the uh, the stack of what we're going to send them for a grading. All right. Drew Eubanks, David Roddy for a rookie. Jaden Ivey, nice. There we go. Getting solid rookies now. Promising ones, Dale and Terry got his tail explosion last time. Nice pickup. Is this Jake LaRavia? Yep. Jake LaRavia. Get Damon Lillard, Dame Dollar Sign, Oshai Ag Agbaji for our other rookie. Let's go. This thing's loaded. This is good. This is good. <laughs> Another Paolo Bencaro to add to the stack to send in. Awesome. That's what I'm talking about. Jeremy Soshan, nice, and he was our Teal Explosion. Let's see who we get here. Bam. Jalen Johnson, uh, nice, nice uh, probably a strikeout, not sure yet. <laughs> Dang, all right. Uh, arriving now, Dalen Terry, not bad. Pure Players, Trey Young. And what do we got here for our last card? Boom. Frequent Flyers. Oh, let's go. <laughs> Cade Cunningham. All right, this made up for it. Most definitely. Frequent Flyers. Cade Cunningham. Nice and crisp. Awesome. Also going to be like put on to the rookies that we send out for grading. All right. So let's just do like, like a little quick comparison here. What we got. So talking about main actual hits we're getting here. We've got that Cade Cunningham. I'll oh, actually set them aside in front here. Alan Terry, Jeremy Soshan, John Johnson, not too much of a hit to be honest. That other Paulo, what should it be? Well, the rookies are always solid to pick up, so that's good. But if I were to get some, I get that Jaden Ivey as well, David Roddy, another Paulo. Uh, was that Vince Carter was another nice pickup. Skyview, that Zion Williamson was awesome. Nice, solid. Sorry, one second. Uh, Royce O'Neal, that's right, for this part. Jason Tatum was nice to pick up, but not so much. Marjan Bochamp. All right, Tata Washington Jr., Bendik Mathurin, that was solid. Trying to find the standouts that we had. Butts from base out LeBron James. That DeJounte Murray was solid. Not so much. More rookies. Seven Curry variant was a pretty cool pickup. Jabari Smith Jr., that's right, as well as Jaden Hardy for purple. Dale and Terry, which one was this Teal Explosion? Yup, the Giannis. This was the highlight, I remember now. Sorry, long video. <laughs> nice pickup right there. 
the Jonathan Kaminga as well. Let's keep scanning through here. Some inserts, CJ Liddell, Kenny Lofton Jr. Luca base set card, which is cool. Oh, let's try Christian Braun, Bowens Highland. Nice, oh, let's try the Paul Bancaro was a nice pickup too. For our rookie stack, Lonnie Walker the fourth, Jaden Hardy, Vince Carter, Mobley, Isaiah Mobley, AJ Griffin, Jabari Smith Jr. variant, as well as this other Christian Braun. So overall, I would say this was what we expected mostly. Not like one big hit. This is definitely bigger than the last one we got where our biggest hit was just uh, um, uh, that Joel and Beeb Teal Blue Explosion. But for these, it's not as clear to me because I haven't really pulled these cards before, but definitely higher quality. A little gilded. Like I said before, the gilded race cards are always awesome. And Isaiah Jackson for the rookie. Uh, Dwayne Washington Jr., this awesome pull of LeBron James here for the amazing, amazing cards. Jalen Green, rookie, Dayron Sharp. We got this nice little reflective raised print, Franz Wagner. So we're trying to move this stuff out of the way. That Jonathan Kaminga card, nice and cool. It's like the photo is right next to them. It's pretty sick too. Oh, that's right, that, uh... Dirk Nowitzki chasing the Hall card was pretty cool too. Luke Garza for a rookie. I think what was our big standout was those two LeBron James cards, but we'll double check here. Luke Garza, Trey Murphy the third. Oh, that's right. The King of Cards, Trey Young was really cool. Davian Mitchell. These are base sets I set aside. The Tyler Hero, Joshua Primo for the rookie card. Oh, that's right. Big hit right here. Intriguing player, Stephen Curry, Gilded, Rays card. Set that aside. Ayo Dasunmu. He said Nikola Jokic, Kevin Durant. Rookie, Trey Mann. Bass, Charles Bassey. Oh, that's right, here we go. Shining Stars, LeBron James. Nice, sick insert right there. That's dope. Trade in Watford, Usman Garuba. Instant impact, that's right, for Quentin Grimes. Base set LeBron James. Rookie card, Evan Mobley. That was a nice little pickup, too. Key rookies to look out for. The Damon Lillard, King of Cards. Trey Murphy, the third. Anthony Edwards, and that Luca base set. So, in terms of like big hits, I would say that the Panini Illusions was a lot better. Having these. Uh, Having not just Evan Mobley rookie, but the rest of the rookies as well. But these big hits right here, pulling two LeBron James cards as well as one Stephen Curry card was like really cool. I have never gotten that yet in like pack opening so far, as well as some of these gilded main players like uh, Damian Lillard. I would say, hmm, I gotta think about this. NBA Hoops for sure is better on picking up key rookies that you need to complete a set. Or, like, people you think are going to blow up during the season. Panini Illusions, I think, that definitely is the chase for these, like, really solid veterans that are going to be the Call of Famers for sure. Higher ceiling. I think that these are worth a lot more probably than what you're going to find. Unless you find, like, a really solid rookie within the, within the NBA Hoops cards. Like, the best that we pulled out of the NBA Hoops was just that, uh, I'm trying to find it can't find it but uh, right now but it's that uh that teal blue explosion um I don't know set this aside so I can search for it. it was a teal blue explosion Giannis Antetokounmpo the fact that that was our only big strike out of like the whole pack is definitely saying something for the rookies I would say not for the rookies but for the veterans that you're trying to pull from the NBA hoops cards Pretty low ceiling, but this is definitely just a higher one to pick up the rookies on. So that would be my suggestion. Dang, where is... can't even find that card right now. Oh, maybe I set it on the left-hand side, that's why. Yeah, Jari Smith Jr., see what I'm saying? All these rookies are what you're really targeting. Some vets. Bonnie Walker the fourth. Paul Bancaro, like I said, Jonathan Kaminga. Vince Carter.
There it is. I think it took forever to find that, sorry. Yeah, one big hit for the veterans on the NBA hoops, and it's definitely like a gamble because you have like ripped open just like 150 cards just to find one decent veteran Teal Blue Explosion or any variant of that sort. Versus like we openly opened like eight packs out of 96 cards within the Panini Illusions, and we pulled these great cards right here. So, so that's gets my suggestion. If you're looking more for veterans, go for the Panini Illusions as long as they have them out. I know it's tough to find these cards. I just got lucky, found them on sale. And you're just trying to build a set of like rookies gambling on what's going to happen during the season. Definitely try out the NBA hoops. Well, thanks for this pack comparison. Hope you take the suggestion. Uh, thanks for watching and uh, continue watching all the videos. Uh, I'll have the next one teed up. I think it's like a mega box comparison as well as the grading videos. So thanks for watching and hope you guys join again.